what happened is the United States and European Union mobilized this virulent nationalist group out of Lvov in Western Ukraine, among whom were these neo-Nazis who worship Stepan Bandera and the, Band, uh, the Banderista movement, uh, which was a pro-Nazi Ukrainian national movement, carried out a resistance in that area for decades. Um, these guys came in and took over Maidan, violently overthrew the, the, the legitimate president of Ukraine, and then imposed themselves through force of violence into the Ukrainian body politic. To give you an example of how powerful they are, when Poroshenko, who was the president before Zelensky, uh, negotiated the Minsk Accords in 2015, 2014, 2015, you know, he agreed that all they had to do is give a special autonomous situation to the status to the Donetsk and Lugansk, and they would stay part of Ukraine. He agreed with Germany and France. Then he came back and the neo-Nazis said, if you try and implement that, we'll kill you. Americans get upset with a bunch of rioters taking the capital and then leaving the same day. I get upset about it. I'm not happy about it. But the, it ain't an insurrection. An insurrection is what happened in Ukraine. What's happening every day. Zelensky was told. He was elected to be the president who brought peace. If you remember, Zelensky toured the front line because they were supposed to disarm. And he went up to the Azov Battalion, and he said, disarm. And they laughed at him, kicked him out. He said, I'm the president of Ukraine. They said, shut up. We'll slap you. He had to leave. And he was told, if you sign Minsk, we will hang you by the neck until dead. That's the control these people have. And they've done it in the military. They, you know, These people should have been disbanded, arrested, shot. Instead, the military absorbed them and then promoted their officers throughout the ranks so that there's neo-Nazis everywhere. And the biggest embarrassment of all is when British, American, and Canadian troops go to Ukraine to train that military and NATO tactics, NATO equipment. The photographs show that they're training the Azov Battalion because those were the first units the Ukrainian military brought forward for training. We trained Nazis.